result of uh, hip hop. If you look at a NFL stadium before the boom of hip hop and look at it afterwards, you'll see the difference. The black kids needed something to hold their hat to. It brought fans. It brought people to love the Raiders. It was great. When I got to the NFL at retail, the business was about $300 million. And when I left uh, seven and a half years later in 1993, it was uh, close to $3 billion. Later on, they were selling Kings, L.A. Kings gear, you know, and I think L.A. Kings had some flowery type colors before that. During that time, I called Al Davis and asked him whether or not, you know, that was going to be okay with him or not or cool. I didn't want to upset him or anything. Yeah, I didn't like it, but yeah, they right. didn't. No, well, I didn't. I didn't like it that any team was going to use black and silver. Those are our colors. And then uh, a couple of baseball teams started to go to it. Our sales, of course, went through the roof once we changed those colors. It was uh, an unbelievable phenomenon. They did have beautiful uniforms. I will say that for them. It was classic. Hold up, who stop this, man? I don't know what I'm thinking about. 